Hey everyone, Aslam the Toy. Welcome to my channel. Hope you guys are awesome today. If you are not following this channel as yet, be sure to hit the subscribe bell, hit the notification bell. And I basically teach home business owners, network marketers, how to build their business and add other multiple streams of income to their businesses so that you never ever depend on just one stream of income. So with that being said, today I'm going to share with you a really, really cool way of you know building yourself another income stream using a very awesome google trick okay now don't take this lightly i actually came across this information originally uh in a course that i bought and i, I paid like two thousand five hundred dollars for this course and when the guy like showed us this trick i was i was actually blown away because i didn't know you could do this with google so be sure to stay until the end because I'm going to take you through that towards the end of the video, okay? But what we're going to speak about uh, is, is creating a business without being too spammy, right? Creating a business where you promote other people's products. Now, why would you want to promote someone else's product? Well, it's quite simple because then you don't have to do the work. You don't have to do the back-end design of the website and, you know, give people the product. All you are doing is promoting it, okay? So what we're going to do first is we need to find an offer that we want to promote. In fact, I would say we first need to de decide on a niche. So what I would do is think about something that you are already passionate about. So I, I love fitness, right? So if you're someone that loves fitness or maybe you want a weight loss journey, because I'll use a weight loss example for this particular video. But let's just say you are on a weight loss journey and you, you, you want to find a way to basically make some money from this. Maybe you've got a bit of a following and people are already asking you for advice on, you know, what exercises do I do? What, you know, what do I eat? And, and that sort of thing, right? So you want to make some money from that. You want to monetize it, but you need an offer, but you don't want to create your own offer because maybe you don't have the know-how of how to do that, Okay. If you don't have the know-how, what is the other best alternative? Well, you could create or you could promote someone else's product. So what I'm going to do right now, I'm going to hop over to a website where we can basically find you a product. Okay. So this is the awesome thing. Even if you've never done this before, you don't even need to create the product. I'm going to show you where you can go and find the product that you are basically going to make some money from. And if you do this consistently, guys, uh, some of the things, uh, most of the things I show you, they are not get rich quick schemes or anything like that. Okay. It does take some work and anything worthwhile is going to take a little bit of effort, right? But I think what you're going to find is that this is probably one of the easiest, but probably one of the most lucrative business models that you could potentially apply as well. Okay. So let's hop over onto this website so I can show you exactly where you can find your offer, which you're going to promote let's just say in the weight loss niche, which is going to be our example for this evening. Okay, so you want to create an account for yourself on ClickBank. Now, if you don't know what ClickBank is, it's probably one of the largest affiliate marketing product databases out, uh, you know, in the world, right? Uh, and what, P, what they basically do is someone will create a product and as opposed to them trying to sell the product by themselves, they come and they put the product onto ClickBank. Okay, other people then take that product and they go and uh, they go and promote it on their own platforms. And whenever, uh, you know, someone buys that product, guess what? You now earn a commission for the product that just got sold. But how do you go about choosing a product? Well, like I said, choose a niche first. Okay, now, if anyone is watching this, I'm based in South Africa. So I know a lot of people ask me, well, how do I get paid with ClickBank? Does it work in South Africa? It does work. It's just when you choose your payment option in South Africa, you're going to need to choose the Payoneer option, okay? Now, Payoneer is a, it's a global payment platform and ClickBank will basically give you access uh, or give you the option to make that your payment mechanism. Unfortunately, you cannot get the money paid into your PayPal account. Uh, the only other way is to get the money paid directly into a bank account, which I found that actually doesn't work. So it's much better to get the money paid into the Payoneer account. Okay. So let's go ahead and let's search over here 
uh, weight loss, right? So you can see I've got your weight loss and we're gonna search weight loss. Okay, so here are the results for weight loss. So we're gonna scroll through here. Now what you are seeing in front of you is basically a bunch of products that fall within the weight loss niche. Okay, so how do you read this? As you can see here, the average commission that you get when someone sells, for example, this 2020 new weight loss offer, you're earning $43, okay? Uh, now, something you want to pay attention to here, you'll see some of them have this thing called recurring bill, uh, $8.30, okay? What this means is there's probably a monthly payment that members make for this uh, particular offer, which means every time they pay their monthly bill, uh, you also get paid a commission as well. So you might want to look at some of those if you want to build a residual passive income by being an affiliate. And then you'll get others that are more just like a one-time offer. Okay, so you can see with this one over here, the average commission, for example, here is $32.53. It's a 75% commission level. Okay, so let's do this. Let's click on this link. Let's check out this product. Now, what's really awesome about promoting someone else's product is, like I said, you don't need to create any of the websites. You don't need to create the product. It's actually all created for you already. All you've got to do is basically promote the product, right? So if you have a look at this, you can see here, uh, this is a really nice looking website. It's speaking about weight loss, okay? It's called the Bulletproof Weight Loss System right and there's some really good uh, copywriting there's some testimonials people that have basically achieved some results you know using this system and uh, i see a lot of females on this uh, page so you know this might appeal more uh, you know if you want to basically get more females attracted to this product uh, or if you want to get more people attracted maybe you know uh, show it to uh, the what more of the female sort of fitness audience or weight loss audience okay and you can see over here, this product is $47.97 and you earn $32 when this product gets sold. Okay, so that is essentially the product. All we've now got to do is we've got to go and promote it. Now, you don't have to worry about how you're going to get paid. What will happen is because you've got a ClickBank account, every time someone buys this product, it's already automatically linked to you. And the money will then be uh, generated. Your commission will be generated by ClickBank. Tried every weight loss okay, so there is a video there. So let's just. But you still lose weight? Or do you always regain the weight you lose? This is not your. Right. So you don't need to create anything. Every time the product gets sold, ClickBank collects the money. And they will then pay it out to whichever payment method you selected. They'll pay that money to you. Okay, so how do we go about promoting this? Step number one was you're going to select your niche. Step number two, you're going to select your product. Step number three is we want to promote it. So you'll see over here, there's a promote button. We're gonna click on this promote button. And what basically happens is this page will now pop up and this is where you need to create a link for yourself, right? So this is my account nickname. I'll just put that in there and I'll click on generate link. Okay, so at the bottom here, you'll see it's now created a link for me. Okay, now you can see this link. It's got, a, it, it doesn't look very nice. It's got a bunch of numbers and it says ClickBank in here. So you probably don't want to be promoting this. What you can now do is you're going to copy the link. Okay, so you're going to copy that link and we're going to go over to another website. Okay, so once you've copied that link with ClickBank or from ClickBank, you are basically going to come to a website and open an account with bit.ly.com. Now, it is free. You don't need to pay anything for this. But bit.ly allows you to shorten those longer links into something that looks a bit more palatable and, you know, more presentable, right? And I'm going to show you a neat little trick here as well. And I'll explain to you as we go on in the video why this is so cool. All right. So what you want to do is once you have your bit.ly account, you'll come to the top. You'll uh, create a link. And this will open up and you will basically paste it over there. Okay, let's just take that out. Okay, now you're going to click on create. Now I've already created this link. And essentially what will happen is it will create a link 
that's going to also have bit.ly forward slash, and it's going to have a bunch of numbers, right? So let's just see if it will do that for us. Okay, so it's going to look something like this over here, right? You can see there it says 3LED. So that doesn't really look very cool. And what you're going to find when I show you the rest of this video, when we go on to some of the other websites, you're going to see that people tend to use this link the way it looks right now. They tend to use that link as their promotion link. But you want to be taking it even a step further, right? So let me show you what we're going to do. So over here, I've taken that link. Let's just take this away. Here we go. It's the second one. Okay. So instead of having that ugly uh, number behind the name or behind that uh, code, okay, you're basically going to put in something cool. Like I've put in here, easy weight loss with Aslam. Okay. Now when I drop it, this is what people will see. It just looks a lot better as opposed to it saying uh, Bitly. Uh, forward slash 375, whatever the code is that Bitly gives you. So this makes it look even more personalized so that when you go out and promote the link, it's just going to look a lot more presentable. So let's move on to the next step because now we want to go and find places using Google where we can go and promote this link. And I'm going to show you exactly how we're going to do that. Okay, so now the next step is you want to come over to Google. And we are going to put in weight loss, the plus sign plus blog, right? Because what we are looking for, is we're looking for weight loss blogs. So if you don't know what blogs are, blogs are basically websites where people post information on various topics. Okay, this is why it's so important, uh, you know, to choose a niche so you know exactly what it is that you're looking for, right? So let's just scroll down. And I searched this one a little bit earlier, and it was a really cool one. So we're going to use this one here as our example. It's called fitfoundme.com. So we're going to click on that, and I'm going to show you how we're going to basically go about promoting our link. Okay, so over here, we are now on this website, okay? And you can see it's pretty much designed, you know, for, for females. Remember, we're promoting a product that probably will appeal to females as well, right? So... On blogs, what you'll typically find is many of them have a comments section. So there would basically be an article. You've probably seen this before. There would probably be an article and you would read this article. And at the bottom, you're going to find what? You're going to find comments, right? So people are reading this and, you know, they are basically giving the input, right? So just look at this here. Remember I told you now you've got this bitly link. And, uh, you know, you now want to promote it. But look at what this person is doing over here. They're probably also promoting a product, right? Whatever product it is. And they've got a Bitly link. But look at that. They've, they haven't even, like, really personalized, right? It just says that code at the back. That's why I showed you that little trick where you can really personalize it, you know, so that it looks a bit better, right? And if you scroll down a bit more, look there. There's another person. They dropped their Bitly link. Here's another person. But look, all these people are just dropping these links and... They are not personalizing it, right? You're going to stand out from the crowd. Now, I highly recommend that you avoid uh, just coming and dropping your link on some of these blogs, right? Because what, th what that does is it just sort of shows people that you're not really interested in helping them. You're interested in only making money for yourself. So what you want to do on these blogs is sort of build up a relationship, right? You want to start uh, becoming uh, someone where, let's just, and this is why I said, you want to take a, a, a niche that, you are passionate about. So if you lost weight, if you have that story, you could come in here, drop a comment and tell your story about how you were so overweight and, you know, uh, you started getting into fitness and now one year later, you're at your goal weight and you really look amazing. And you could do that on all these different blogs that you're going to find uh, by searching Google, right? Um, but the last thing you want to do is just spam your link all over. But what is going to be awesome is that when you eventually do put that link, you're already going to stand out compared to all these other people that are just dropping that really ugly looking bitly link. Because yours, remember mine said uh, uh, easy weight loss with Aslam, right? So yours could be easy weight loss with whatever your name is. I'm just giving don't use the same thing. I'm just giving you an example. Okay. But now it looks more personalized, right? 
Uh, you could even take this a step further. Maybe this blog over here, a lot of these blogs, they tend to have Facebook groups. Maybe you could go and join their Facebook group and sort of network with the ladies in that group. And you can provide some uh, stories about your journey. And as they become more familiar with you and they start trusting your, your recommendations, now you start saying, well, you know what, uh, in the comments section, you know, you could drop your links there and say, yes, uh, just check out this. This is what I've basically tried before. And it's given me some amazing results as part of my journey. Okay. Now, it's always good if you can try some of those products because who knows, you, you know, it's easier to promote something you've actually tried yourself. Okay. But you could then just drop that link over there and it looks a lot better. Okay. Now, you could go and look for multiple blogs every single day. Uh, you know, where you could basically connect with people and then eventually drop your link. And let's just say you do about, say, 10 blogs a day. Chances are you're going to make a sale somewhere. It's an, like, really, it's a numbers game, right? So chances are you will uh, make money somewhere. You know, out of that 10, maybe one person is going to buy or two people are going to buy. And that's how you'll be making that $100 a day because you're earning like $30 to $40 just on selling just that one product and you can buy, you can basically promote multiple products on ClickBank. But I do suggest staying within a, that certain niche. But now I'm going to show you the Google trick that I promised you where you can accelerate, uh, you know, the uh, way you can find these blogs. So instead of you going and manually scrolling through Google, you know, to find the blogs, what if there was a way where Google basically shows you the blogs around the weight loss topic? What if that was possible? Well, it is. And guess what, guys? I basically found this out through a course that I did that cost me a couple of thousand dollars. Okay. It was not the only thing they shared with me, but it was one of the most valuable things that I learned because I didn't know about this and I think you're going to love it. So let's check this out. So basically we are back on Google, right? And here's what we're going to do next. We are going to put in weight loss. Oh no, wait, wait we're going to put in Google alerts. There we go. Google alerts. Now, Google Alerts is basically a functionality that is on Google where you can put in a topic that interests you. I get multiple Google Alerts every day on various niches that I'm interested in. And then I just go through that information and I see what I'm interested in and uh, if it's a, a, a place where I can promote a product that I'm currently promoting. So we're going to click over here on Google Alerts. It's the first link. Okay, and let's just say we want to create, it says here, create an alert about what? So what do we want to create alert about? Let's say we want a, an alert on weight loss. Weight loss blogs. Okay. So we're going to create alert. All right, so you'll see it comes up over here. You can see here I've got multiple alerts set up down here. So now I'm going to go and edit this alert. So how often, so maybe you don't want this every day. Let's just say you only want this once a week, at most once a week, right? Otherwise, you're going to get your mailbox filling up all the time, right? Automatic, it's going to send it through. You want it in English, assuming that's the language you want, any region, uh, only the best results. And where do you want it delivered? You want it delivered to your email address. So now you're going to set up the alert, and what will now happen is every single week, because if you set it up for once a week now, Google is going to send you an email, okay, where it's going to tell you that uh, 100 weight loss blog uh, articles were written this week and here are the links. You're going to get that in your email. So maybe you could just go in there once a week and then for the following week, you've got, you've already like sh uh, shortlisted all these different, uh, you know, blogs that you want to go and visit. Uh, you know, over the uh, over the coming week and where you're going to basically be networking and placing your link. Okay, that now guys, that is a really, really awesome automated way of being informed all the time so that you don't have to manually go and find these blogs on your own. Google is going to send it to you. How cool is that? Okay, so this functionality is absolutely brilliant. I'm just going to remind you once again, the biggest mistake you can make is if you take your, your ClickBank link and then just go and blast it all over social media and all over the internet. People will not click on it. You want to be building relationships first on these blogs. And uh, after a while, once you've told your story and you can see people are engaging with you, that is when you want to start dropping these links. 
Okay, so you're gonna probably find Quora coming up. There's a website called Quora, uh, you know, on, uh, on 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 the internet, and Google will probably show you some uh, articles and questions that were typed in Quora. Okay, and you could probably go there and network with people there as well. That is an excellent way of building relationship first. Remember, people will only buy from you when they know you, like you, and trust you, or when they feel like they know you, like you, and trust you. Okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Go ahead, drop a comment if you try this out and you get some results. Uh, you know, I would love to see some success stories out there. And guys, just stay consistent and never give up on those goals. Aslam Dutoy, and I'll see you on the next video.